this video we want to talk about using work offsets or G54 through 59 with a conversational program. And there are a couple things that have to be met, a couple conditions that need to be met to do this. And the first one is our program type. If we go into our program type and look at program properties, it has to be a universal program. This won't work with any of the older types like standard or rotary A or something like that. It has to be a universal. That's number one. Number two, the NC and conversational types have to be the same. So I'm going to go into my utilities screen here, go to user preferences and NC settings. I want to make sure that my NC display type is also universal. And the last thing we need to do is also here under user preferences, part and tool settings, we have to be using absolute tool length. If all those conditions are met, inside of our conversational program, we can insert a block, go under the miscellaneous, more, and you should see this work offset button. If it is grayed out, that means that one of the conditions that I just mentioned haven't been met. If you go back and make sure all those are, are correct, then this should be selectable. And it's going to put a block in the program called Work Offset, where I can pull down from the menu, select the uh, G54 through 59, or one of the 93 um, auxiliary offsets that we have, and be able to use that in the conversational program. So if we go back to the review screen, we see that block one is work offset using G54.1 offset one. This is an auxiliary offset location one. So from that point on in the program, it's going to use G54.1. P1, if I were to um, do some blocks here, maybe had two vices on the table, I wanted a G54.1 P1 to be my left vice. My next one, I could do a miscellaneous more work offset. Go back again to my auxiliaries, for example, and use two. Then from that point on in the program, it would be referencing this new uh, work offset location. So this is a really good way to be able to switch back and forth between multiple setups or having a vice or something that's set up all the time where it makes it easy for um, for me to set this job up, all I have to do is call up the work offset that I know has already been touched off. And regardless of whatever I have in my part setup, once it sees that in the conversational program, that work offset will become the active work offset.